This is Bragg Flair at Independence Central awaiting word on the signing of the Declaration of Independence. Meanwhile, we take you back to the events which led up to this historic moment. First to London. Hello! This is Frosty David, February 13, 1766. Today, Benjamin Franklin was examined before the House of Commons. Mr. Franklin, what's been going on in there? Everybody was kung fu fighting. Ben, reports are you're working on a new invention. What exactly is it? Jolly good, then. What does it do? <laughs> Cheerio, Ben. Now to Stu Dio. <clears throat> oh, my own man. Uh, this is Stu Dio, July 18, 1768, and a far-out song was written about America, man. And John Dickinson is here, and he wrote it. Hey, John, why'd you write the song? Uh, that's heavy, man. Uh, who's the group? <laughs> Thanks for stopping by to rap, man, but we gotta rap. <laughs> this is Studio. Microphone here, live at the Boston Tea Party, December 16, 1773. How could this be happening? Where are the British guards? Smoking in the boys' room. Here's British Lieutenant Bingo. Lieutenant Bingo, is that really true? No, 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 I don't smoke it no more. Well then, just exactly what were you doing? Did you realize that something was wrong at the harbor? But Lieutenant Bingo, you still haven't answered my question. How could this have happened while you were in charge? I got stoned and missed it. I got stoned and missed it. One final question. Who's going to clean up this mess? We thank you to the midnight ride of Paul Revere. The excitement is mountain. This is Chuck Roast with Paul Revere. Paul, when will you be making your historic ride? One of these crazy old nights. What mount have you chosen for the ride? Wildfire. Tell me, Paul, what's so special about wildfire? It's the white wall. TV enters in the back. But, Paul, with the British about to arrive, how can you be sure you won't run into any? There's a good feeling helping me to find my way. But, Paul, what will you be shouting in the middle of the night to wake everyone up? Fire! It's the signal in the tower. It's time for Paul Revere to ride. For 1776, the Declaration of Independence has just been signed. The crowds are going wild, and here comes John Hancock. Mr. Hancock, do you really have faith in this new declaration? One final question. We now live in a new country. How do you feel? This is Brad Flair, and that's the way it was, July 4th, 1776.